Nicola Sturgeon has signaled a limited climb down over the question for a second independence referendum after being told to change her plans by MSPs. The First Minister had wanted to reuse the same yes-slash-no question put to voters in 2014, should Scotland be an independent country? She wanted to stop the Independent Electoral Commission retesting the question for fairness, accusing those wanting it to be involved of trying to rig the whole process. Although the watchdog approved the yes-slash-no format five years ago, in 2016 it demanded a leave-slash-remain format for the EU referendum in case yes had an unfair advantage. The SNP want to keep the yes-slash-no format as their campaigning is based on it, while their opponents want to change to leave-slash-remain because of its toxic echoes of Brexit. Ms Sturgeon, who wants to hold in Diaf 2 in the second half of 2020, is now offering MSPs a specific say on whether the Commission becomes involved. The Scottish Government's referendums bill, which would pave the way for that vote, provided Westminster agreed says the Commission must test all referendum questions for fairness and intelligibility. However it includes a controversial exemption for questions which have been previously approved by the Commission, a clause aimed squarely at the question of 2014. In evidence sessions before Holyrood's Finance and Constitution Committee, a series of academic experts warned against allowing such an exemption, saying the Commission should be allowed to test all questions, regardless of their previous use. The Commission itself also said it wanted to test all questions, so that it could take into account changes of context and fresh evidence about their suitability. Last month the cross-party committee unanimously agreed. In its Stage 1 report, it said the government had to rewrite the flawed legislation to reflect the weight of evidence in favour of letting the Commission test the question. It said the government must come to an agreement with the Commission about that testing before the bill proceeds any further at Holyrood. Opposition parties said the verdict was a humiliation for the First Minister. Until now, Ms Sturgeon and her Brexit Secretary Michael Russell have refused to change the bill, with Mr Russell claiming a different question in Indiaf 2 would only confuse voters. However, after a constructive discussion with the Commission last week, Mr Russell has now tabled an amendment to the bill which would change that. He proposes limiting the use of any question to the lifetime of the Parliament which approved it, meaning no more than five years in practice. However this validity period could be extended to two parliamentary terms for a previously approved question if MSPs voted in favour of such an extension. This would still allow TH for more on this story, visit the news article link.